Welcome everybody to this first Death Diary video about Son of Nor. My name is Julian Maudner and I'm the lead developer at Still Alive Studios. In this video I want to show you our light shaft system and how it works. As you might know, Unity has a built-in solution for light shaft, which is this one here, but it is a screen-based approach, meaning that the sun or whatever light source you're using has to be visible on the screen in order to make the light shafts appear. Our system on the other hand creates permanent light shafts which can be seen here and if we select this system here we see that we have a nice light shaft creator script in the inspector which allows us to dynamically create all those light shafts with a single click. Basically, these light shafts are overlaid transparent quads. There are many of them and of course you could put them manually in too, but our system takes care of all the generation on its own. Here is how it works. So basically you define a light source, which in this case is the sun. And you define a couple of different parameters, for instance, the light map that is used to create it and so on. And then you hit create, store the light shaft asset, and it's created on the fly. As you see, for this, for these light shafts, um, about 300 quads have been created. So it should not be too bad for the performance. And if we look at those, you see they look very nice. So let's jump in and check out how they look like in real time within the game. Okay, so we are in now and as you can see here are the light shafts. It's really nice and very smooth light shafts here which really look awesome nearly from any direction. Our solution is even capable of generating shadow shafts, as you can see here. With that, I would like to end this dev diary. I hope you enjoyed it. Like us on Facebook or follow us on Twitter. And I hope to see you next time.